You said Mr. Tyler is coming back to the country. Yes. And you're not going to meet him. No. Why? Why not? <laughs> I mean, isn't it really, you're really not serious, right? Because if there's something you both have been looking forward to, is to finally meet each other. You know that because? Because I hear your conversations. I hear you say things like, I can't wait to meet you. I can't wait to marry you. I can't wait to be your wife. I can't wait to love Enough, okay? It's clearly obvious that you've been listening to our conversations. But do I need to tell you that it's one thing to say something and it's another thing to mean it? Are you trying to tell me that you've been deceiving this man? Or is this a case of fraud or what? Fiona, I don't see why any of this is your problem. Okay, I'm an adult. I can decide to see whoever I want to see and whoever I don't want to see. Mr. Tyler is not whoever. Then who is he? He's everything to you, Isabel. He's been there for you. I don't care. What's your problem? Something. It's just a simple business idea. Just come up with something, anything good. You have to think, okay? Thank God you're back home on time. I need your help. I need you to join hands with mine. <laughs> I'm surprised. Oh, finally you need my help. Uh, I thought you know everything. Uh, of course not. You know they say two heads are better than one. Just consider this as a case of women supporting women. Okay. Yes. So what are you up to? I need a business idea. <sighs> okay. A business idea that is worth 20 million. What? Why are you shouting? 20 million naira? Keep your voice down. Is it you want to million in your account? Sitting down like that. I don't have 20 million naira in my account. So whose account is it then? Tyler's account, of course. Mm -hmm. 
What are you up to? Well, I just... I just need to get some money from him. 20 million naira. Because once he gets back into the country, our relationship will start shaking. And why? Why our relationship will start shaking is none of your business, okay? What's more important here is the business idea I need to come up with. Uh, I just need that money so I can just be going forward. So you are planning to discard this man, Abby? Don't put it like that. Okay. You see this? I am not involved. Cut me out. Fiona, what is wrong with you? Out. What is wrong with you? What happened to the case of women supporting women? Just supporting this small thing that I need you to help me do now is a big problem for you. After you say you are my friend. Hello, you're not a good friend. You're the worst friend ever. <sighs> worst friend ever. But Isabel, can you just come up with something? You don't have time. You don't have time. Every time you keep depending on Fiona, now she says she doesn't want to help you. Come up with something. Think. Think. You have brain. Stop behaving like a dullard. Okay, fish business. Fish. Hey, Cherry Blossom. You do have a dictionary for sweet names, don't you? <laughs> if I don't call you sweet names, who will? No one. How are you, my darling? Um, fine, but not so fine. What's wrong? Um, it's not something that you can't handle. Oh, well, talk to me, baby. Darling, you know, you were asking me what kind of business or something I would love to do. I have made up my mind. Come on, then. You know, I'll do anything for you. Anything and everything. Yeah, I want to start a business. Oh, you know, I'm a business person. I love business-minded people. Yeah. So, um, I'll be needing a lot of money. How much are we talking about here? Um, about 20 million. 20 million Naira? What kind of business are we talking about here? Babe, it's a very good business. You know, I can send you the business plan if you want. Um, you know what? Why don't you wait till I get into Nigeria so we can work on it together? Babe, I'm sorry, but it's just that it's a bit too late. I don't have so much time. I really need to start this business as soon as possible. Come on, baby. You don't have to rush into business like that. But babe, you... Relax. Before you know it, I'll be there. Time, you know. Come on. But nothing, baby. Now let the countdown of my coming to Nigeria begin. <laughs> I love you, baby. Yeah. Goodness, five days to his coming. I'm not looking forward to this at all. Not. Today, tomorrow. I was thinking, why not we throw Tyler a welcome party? Keep thinking. Isabel, what is wrong with you? Huh? Listen, I'm just trying to be a good friend. Mm. And I don't want you to lose what you have. Trust me. Mm. A good friend indeed. Well, I can see you're more invested into his coming than I am. Oh yes, I'm more invested because you're not even invested at all. I don't know if you think about what you're doing, but <laughs> Tyler does not deserve this. You need to stop it. Enough! Enough, okay? This whole thing is
is already stressing me out. You need to appreciate me and cut me some slack. Wait. Are you trying to insinuate that I am indebted to Tyler? You need to see how I'm feeling. You need to feel what I'm feeling. I am stressed. And besides, it's my life, okay? It's my life, so leave me alone. Let me be. Okay. Ah. Okay, Fiona, okay. Fiona, it's okay. Mm -hmm. It is not your life, it's her life. So yes. mind your business. Mind your business. I'm done. Yes, be done. What's your problem? Tyler is coming. I'm thinking of this. I'm thinking of that. Is he your boyfriend? I want to cry more than the bereaved. Let's think of what to do. She's not even helping matters. Dear Tyler, please, let him cancel his flight. I don't want that guy to come. Yeah. Nigeria tomorrow. Oh my gosh! I'm so excited. I can't really contain myself. I'm gonna see you for the first time tomorrow. <laughs> I can't wait to hold you in my arms. I'm gonna kiss you on your lips, kiss you on your face. 55,000 more. <laughs> Hello? You the, hey, baby. What's going on? Anyway, I'm gonna see you tomorrow, so it's not so bad. Da -da. Guess what day it is today? Wake up! So, I will pick your outfit together. together okay to where to the airport of course aren't you going to pick Tyler up madam don't you think it's too early for you to come to my room I need my space Isabel don't tell me you're not going to pick Tyler up he funnily believes that I am going to be at the airport waiting for him with a placard that says Welcome to Nigeria, Tyler. <laughs> when I'm not even stepping an inch out of this house. So, what do you expect him to do? He should find his way to his house, of course. Isabel, you are so unbelievable. Okay, I'll take that as a compliment. So, can you just leave my room? I need to sleep some more. Okay? I can't believe this girl. Man. It's so good to be back. Come back to my dear. Thanks, brother. And I have never been so disappointed. Never been so disappointed in my life, man. <laughs> and it's not funny. Come. Hey, take it upstairs, right? No, but honestly Thank speaking, you. Tyler, I still can't wrap my head around this. You mean, if I hadn't called you on time, you would still be back at the airport waiting for some girl? No, this is not some girl. This is the girl I'm about to marry. Huh. A girl you met online. Well, listen, she's not just some girl I met online. I mean, she's somebody who I've been talking to for almost a year. Just talking to her? Oh, we kind of in a serious relationship, you know? Serious relationship? I mean, I didn't think I'm serious. Man, come on. Look, bro, obviously, this girl does not wait you. She didn't show up. Man, so anything could have happened. Why she didn't come? 
Have you tried calling her? Yeah, cool. Just wait for me outside. Mm -hmm. Listen, man, my try calling her phone is switched off. Her phone is switched off. <laughs> Baba, now you know what you did do. Man, stop this. Man. Anyways, bro, I have to be off to work. Man, my man. man. <laughs> Thank you so much. Good to have you back. Good to be back, bro. I'll see you tomorrow. You know, we could just go around town. Oh, yes. Yeah. Crazy, crazy stuff. Crazy, with crazy. crazy. Do. Don't spoil me too much. <laughs> I'm not going to I'm not going to go. All right, brother. Isabel, what's up, girl? You okay? <laughs> no, I'm not. What's wrong? I had an accident yesterday on my way to the airport. I was unconscious. Uh, are you in the hospital? Yes, I'm in the hospital. I just regained consciousness now and I couldn't wait to talk to you. All right, send me the address. I'm going to come right away. No. For that, my friend is here. Yeah, but I still, I still need to come. Just send me the address. I need to be there. You know, you just go back. You need to rest, okay? You don't need to stress. Besides, um, I'm, I'm about to be discharged from the hospital. It's just the hospital bill that is delayed. Uh, all right. Um, how much is how much is the bill? Three hundred thousand. <laughs> I'll send the money right away, okay? Thanks, baby. Thank you. You should have come. You know, send me your address and I'll come see you later on. Your home address, okay? All right, I will. Please just transfer the money immediately. I don't like the smell of this hospital. Yeah, sure. I'll, I'll do the right away, okay? Thanks, darling. Thank you. Listen. Uh, listen, okay? Whatever you want to say now, I'm not interested. Just keep it. Is everything okay? Remember that girl I told you about that Kate was just come pick me from the airport? Yeah. She was involved in an accident. What? Yeah. She just regained consciousness. And she's at the hospital. I'm just waiting for her to send me the address so I can go check up on her. Wow, that's that's such a pity. Yes. Messed up, man. Oh wait. Did she by any chance happen to ask you for the hospital bill? Yeah, 300k. <laughs> what? Don't tell me you gave it to her. Why would I give it to her? I mean, she, I was the reason why she had the accident. When I got the money, why would I give it to her? See, my God. What are you on about? Bro, relax. Don't tell me to relax. I am in this country because of her. How long has this girl been scamming you? What are you talking about? How is it that you don't see exactly what I'm saying? I don't see what you see and I don't think I want to see what you see. Tyler. What? Come on your shoe. Relax. We can go inside, go bring glass, more shack this drink. 
I can bet you that that girl is not going to send you any address. You want to bet? Hmm? Hello? $500? $500. Oh, well, I would collect my money, right? <laughs> Let's see how it goes. <laughs> Love <a> boy. <laughs> She's gonna send it, right? She'll send it. myself into what was I even thinking that he wasn't going to come back really oh, I swear I didn't think this one well I didn't think it well what am I going to do what am I going to do I miss you baby oh I can't wait to hold your hand you know and kiss you all over kiss your lips your face everything you know, I feel like pulling you through the screen, kissing you, and throwing you on the bed. What? You seem like you like to take control. <laughs> mm -hmm. I just want to show you how it's done. Ah, I really can't wait to be intimate with you, you know. <laughs> Me too, baby. And I promise you 12 rounds. In our first night, Together is going to be really steamy, going to be hot. <laughs> yeah, I just want to let you know that I am very good in bed. 12 rounds? You really can do that much? <laughs> I am very talented, baby. You got a talent that aspect? <laughs> baby, can you please send me some money? So fast? What happened to the one I sent to you? Last week. Uh, I know. But baby, you know how Lagos can be very expensive. Alright, how much do you want? About, mm, I can manage 500,000 Naira. Hmm. That's fine. I'll send you the money now. <gasps> you will? <laughs> Thank you, baby. You're the best boyfriend in the world. <laughs> All right. Done. Thanks, baby. I love you. Bye. Anything for you, baby. I love you. <sighs> oh, 500k. Well. Okay. All right. Bye. Mm. Isabel, mm? you know you're very lucky, right? About what? About Tyler. That man is too rare to find. Yeah. I mean, he loves you. He's good looking. He spends on you. He's sweet. Oh. Mm. What's that? Hmm? I think you don't know what I'm talking about already. I don't know what you're talking about. As for me, I'm just catching crows. Mm hmm. You're catching the crews. Mm -hmm. And cashing out. Yeah. Wait, is this what all this is all about to you? Yes, now. Catching crews and cashing out.
Yes. Don't mind Fiona, she's always like that. Mm-hmm. So, what is it that you wanted to tell me? What? A ring? Oh my God! I'm waiting for this day. I have wanted to do this for a long time. Saying that when you're done from school and service, I'll be able to make this proposal to you. Really? And you waited? I love you, Isabel. I love the thing that I have shown you. But in this year, I love you all my heart. Right now, all I want to do is make you my wife. Oh, this is so beautiful. I have never wanted anything so much. Like I want this right now. Ah. Uh. Isabel Jeffo, you marry me. Um. Yes! She will marry you! <laughs> I really want to say yes, but I was expecting you to do this in person, you know? It's not like I'm going to be able to wear the ring now. Oh, come on, just say yes. And when, I'm, when I see you, I'll give you the ring. Yes, say yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, yes. I'll marry you. Ah. <laughs> Thank you so much for making this a joyful day for me. I can't wait for you to wear this beautiful ring. Yeah, me too. So, um, babe, myself and Fiona, we're going to go out to go celebrate. Can you send me some money, please? No problem, sure. I'll send you. I'm in a good mood. Check your account. Just sent you a million. Isabel, come here! Hug me, We have a wedding to plan, and guess who is the chief bridesmaid, honey? Uh uh. Me! No. <laughs> We have a club to attend, so go get dressed. Are you normal? Are you mad? I'm normal. Go get dressed. <sighs> Fiona, seriously, I am not in the mood for whatever it is you want to say right now. It is so obvious that you don't want to meet Tyler. And my question is, why? Because I am not interested in meeting him. That is your boyfriend! A client! A client! Yes. I met Tyler at the point when I needed help the most. He was more of a helper to me. Isabel, make me understand. You met Tyler on IG when you needed help. And that was exactly when your mother needed surgery. You told him about it and he helped you with a sum of 2.5 million naira. Unfortunately, your mom could not make it. But throughout everything, this guy stood by you, fell in love with you, and asked you out. Do you accept it? Didn't you? Because he agreed to sponsor my education. For your sake. This guy got you an accommodation, sponsored your education. Give you cooling and everything up till now. I don't understand. You don't want to meet him? I, why? Because I don't have feelings for him. I don't. I don't feel anything. I, I, don't, I don't know if I will, I will even be able to stand him when he comes to Nigeria. It's that bad. It's about you're stupid. Just let me be, all right? You don't understand me right now. You don't understand. I don't feel anything for him. I don't even know. Oh, what am I going to do? Dear heart. 
night? Or did you feel something for this guy? Oh, dear God. You know my heart. You know I'm not an ungrateful person. Why don't I have feelings for this guy? Nothing at all. I can't even stand him. I don't even know what to say to him. <sighs> Lord, this is bad. Hey, what's up, though? Tyler, dress up and let's hang out with me. I'll send you the address. Okay. <laughs> I totally understand, Emily. Believe me, mm -mm. I do. Uh, you be sure, babe. Now, nah. don't uh -huh. be you. Eh? No, shine, shine. See, I see the, okay. the sparkle. <laughs> <laughs> That's my new man. Hey, hey. <clears throat> that's the man of the moment. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Come, come see, bro. See here. Ah, uh -huh. yeah. I thought it was supposed to be a man thing. <laughs> Oh yeah? Who's she? I know, here's the thing. This is Emily. She's been my good friend for years. And Emily, mm -hmm. this is Tyler, my best buddy. Yeah, Tyler. Mm-hmm. Nice to meet you, Tyler. How are you, Emily? I'm single. I'm sure you are. She's single. Hmm. I've actually heard a lot of good things about you. Yeah. I'm happy you have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm a good guy. Yeah. But you know the most interesting part is that you are single. Oh no, I'm not single. I am engaged, about to be. I don't mind him, okay? My friend talks silly sometimes. He's no, actually no. very single and ready to mingle. What are you doing? Fuck off, guy. Come on, are you out of your mind? I mean, <laughs> look, um, I have to make a quick call. Yeah, I'll be back with you. You can make no, the no, call no. when you go. Have fun. Okay, just relax. Yeah. Relax. There's a lot of. Yeah. Tyler, come on. Yeah. All right, I'll see you guys sh ah, See you shortly, huh? Don't take too long. Uh, a drink? You um, sure you need a drink? Here you come. That's Desmond's glass. Oh, well, he's not here now, so automatically he's now your glass. I don't know where his mouth has been. <laughs> <laughs> um, so tell me, Tyler, do you have a spec? Okay, <laughs> silly me. Okay, I'll just make this easier for you. Um, am I your spec? <laughs> <laughs> Not really, you know. <laughs> okay, I, you know what, don't answer that. <laughs> I'll let you came back to look for a wife. Oh, you didn't get the full information. I'm actually here to marry my fiance. You know, I'm also single and uh, ready to get married. The Good only feeling. challenge is that I've not really found a man. That's sad. Or maybe I just did. Oh, no, no, you didn't. I mean... Oh, come on, Tyler. <laughs> you know, you're actually my spec, like, oh. exact spec. I'm happy for you. I, I always had this goal of getting married and relocating to another country with my husband. That's good. I'll you going back to the States soon. Yeah. Can't you see? See what? Can't you see, Tyler? We're actually meant for each other. How? We are perfect pair, aren't we? Um, sorry. What are you are you okay? I gotta take this phone call. There's one is Are you coming. leaving? Babe, what's going on? Where where did he go? Guy, you just need to see the way I just sit down here they run my mouth like taps. They speak English where my mama no give me. Wait till now. The guy was not even listening to me. I just they talk, you know, if they do like saying they're going to pay attention. Emily, calm down. Calm down now. Like, if you really want him. You have to put in the work. I told you that he's a man who has his heart in the hands of a girl who does not appreciate him. Mm. So you have to do whatever it takes to grab his heart from her. Yeah. Huh? Omo, I did game. How do you talk now? See me, Emily. 
see that fine bubble. Mm. I could do anything <laughs> for this life. I must get that. Now my man be that desperate. That's the spirit. That's the spirit. Cheers to that. Yes, cheers to Take that. Take good care of him, boys, my buddy. Yes, uh uh. No fuck up, oh. You know Emily, me. Emily, nah. baby. <laughs> but Desmond, but wait, you know me now. Cheers to you that. You know me. Mm. I know they carry my matter plan. I know they carry my men play. I could take care of mm -hmm. her. By the time I rub being head, mm. go cook one better time you give her. <laughs> See that girl, eh? Uh, go fly, come up for him. I don't see the show, baby. Uh, uh, it's too bad. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that money when you carry come back from me, but those mm. dollars. I go teach him how to spend that for you. No chopping money. Oh. Calm down. No chopping money. Show him love. True love. Eh? Hey, your guy said they speak English. Guy. <laughs> what do you expect now? <laughs> now, Yankee guy. Mr. <laughs> Bakon, they speak the English. You will be a good one. You will not get sense. Babe, I just found out about a nice lounge. What about we meet there by 5 p.m.? Let's make it our first date. I'll be there with the ring. Huh. Here's the address. <sighs> nice idea. Why don't you send me the money so I can get a nice dress? Isabel, mm -hmm. this is the best food you have made in your entire life. <laughs> you can say that. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. So this is what Salah is going to be enjoying for the rest of his life. Huh. Hmm. You will never stop, right? What have I done? Isabel, why are you doing this? This man does not deserve this and you know it. What do you expect me to do? Huh? Marry him? Look, that guy is in his what? 40s. And I'm just in my 20s. What was he doing with his life all these years? And you were just finding out about that? Isabel, you knew his age all this while. And you still dated him. Because I thought we were going to end as pen pals. We would never get to see. I didn't know we were going to get this far. And when you knew it was going further than you expected, why didn't you stop it? Why didn't you cut it short? So tell me, what was I supposed to tell him? Hmm? How do I even say it? Now let me tell you how to say it. Mm -hmm. Tyler, I've been scamming you. And the feelings was never mutual. And now that you're done sponsoring me in school and giving me a better life, I am done with you. Please, you just say something. We're not having juice. I would have thought you were drunk. You know, so, so and and what? Look like the bad person. So what would you rather do? Keep it him hanging? Is he really him? Is it bad if you do not want this man? Let him be. Let someone else who deserves him get it. This is enough, okay? It's enough. Why are you crying more than you bereaved? Huh? Are you his what? His sister? His mom? You don't 
you understand? I have tried to make my heart love him, but no, I can't. What do you expect me to do? Force myself? Isabel, I can't believe you. Trust me, I'm done with this conversation. I just can't believe you, Isabel. Yes, be done, okay? Be done. Time is too much. Eat food in peace. No, we must talk. Tyler does not even deserve this. Oh, fine. Then I deserve it to, to live in a loveless marriage. After you say you are my friend. No, advise me now. I should force myself. I should pretend. It's okay. I, I'm done. So... No, no, I thought you were done. You're still eating my food. You're still eating the food. Hey, Isabel, what's up? You didn't show up. Again. What's going on? You just got a call that your uncle died. And you didn't think to tell me this? Come on, what's going on here? Did I do something wrong? It's like you're trying to avoid me or something. I mean, it's... Hello? Oh no, she didn't just cut the phone on me. Did I do something wrong? I came all the way from the States with it. What's going on here? Is something, something you want to tell me? Should I call it back? Hey, baby. 
You know, I could have loved to make you breakfast in bed, but I don't have your spare keys. Not yet. What are you doing here? Uh, I brought breakfast. How do you know I live? Hmm, I'm sure you have the answer to that question already. Look, how about you just go freshen up and I set the table? Hmm? Hey, 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 hey! Come down, Tyler! What makes you think you could come into my house uninvited and unannounced and bring breakfast for me? Look, Tyler, I'm just trying to be that woman that you need. I don't hey. need you to be any woman for me. Well, of course, you don't have to say it. It's written all over you. Hey, if I wanted a woman, I know where to find one. <laughs> Let me guess. Instagram? <laughs> Come on, Tyler. Are you 12? Everyone knows that Instagram girls are just after your money. You have money, you have them. And once they're done with your money, they are done with you. What else did Desmond tell you? How am I supposed to know what I have not been told? All right. Listen to me, okay? Okay. I know what you're about. And if you think that you can hatch something between us, then I think you better think again. Of course. Stop thinking and just start acting. Hey, hey, hey. 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 Come on, Tyler. Listen, Emily, I'm going to ask you in the most nice and respectful way mm. to kind of leave my house now. Mm. Of course I'm going to leave. After we've had breakfast. Get out of my house. Fine. I'll leave. Hey, 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 hey. hey. You. you can have it, dear bachelor. I'm sure you need it more than I do. I just got an invite from Avalon Construction Company. Wait, the same Avalon we know about? Yes, and I can't remember applying for a job there. But I mean, remember Tyler asked for your CV once. But that was a month ago. Babe, an opportunity just on print. Just grab it. Of course I will. At least I will get an alternative source of income. I don't have to depend on Tyler. I can then dump him and move up, and he doesn't have to know. <laughs> so, are you going for the interview? Oh, of course. <laughs> Why not? Oh, babe. Do you know Tyler is the reason? Oh, uh, Tyler, you. You see this rubbish you always do? It's annoying and irritating. Tyler is the reason for the air that I breathe. He's the reason why I'm alive. He's the reason why I have a space on this earth. He's the reason for everything. Stop exaggerating. I am not exaggerating. Every single opportunity you have, you just use it to make me feel like I am indebted to Tyler. Well, just so you know, by the time I have this job, I won't be indebted to anybody, okay? And if you like him so much, why don't you go ahead and marry him? You can't just be happy for someone every this morning. Tyler. Tyler is the reason for this. Tyler is the reason for that. This is annoying me. What is going on? You sounded so serious on the phone. I just confirmed that this girl is avoiding me. What happened? I spoke to a friend of mine, Alicia. I asked her to call Isabel in for a job interview. She went there. When she heard I was coming, she took off. I mean, why would she take off? Is it that bad? Yeah, I mean, why she running away from me? I don't get it. <sighs> Honestly, bro, I don't know what to say to you because obviously you're in love. Yes, I'm in love and Isabel loves me too. It doesn't seem that way though. Mm-hmm. What am I supposed to do now? I mean, I came back to Nigeria because of her. 
I came back to marry her. If there was a problem, why can't you talk to me about it? Hey, bro, just calm down, okay? Don't tell me to calm down. I, I love her. I can't live without her. So, what are you going to do now? I don't know. I guess I'm going to go look for her. You don't have to worry, sir. She's still very much in my view. I'm sure before you hired me, you did your research. I'm the best in the business. She's a couple of feet away from me. I'll let you know when she gets to her house and drives into her compound. Oh, God, who is this guy? Oh, my God. Fiona. Hello, Fiona. I'm being followed. I don't know. Someone has been following me since from town. I just passed our house now. I was too scared to stop. I don't know, but I just think Tyler has a hand in this. I don't know, but I just can't keep driving. I have to stop somewhere. All right, bye, bye. Who is this guy? Let me just go this way. That you dragged me out there just to waste my time. Sam had just one gig. He had one gig and he had to mess it up. Tyler, you really need to snap out of this. There are so many girls in Lagos. Take for example, Emily. Hey, hey. Don't even go there. Okay? Is Emily not beautiful enough? Is she not? Okay, fine. What's your spec? Tell me. I would get hey, you. Hey, 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 Desmond. All right. If you truly my friend, what you can do for me is help me. Help me find Isabel. That's all you got. That's all you got to focus on right now. I don't know, bro. Honestly, I don't know. Wait. Come to think of it, does she have any close friend? I mean, Isabel. Her flatmate. That's, that's, that's her flatmate. I think she try and reach out to her. She just might be able to help. Yeah. Why do I think of that? It's on my phone. Yeah, it's up in my ass.
Hey! Hi! Turn Fiona! Uh, How are you? I'm good. Wow! I, I, I didn't think you were going to come. Why not? I mean, you don't deserve to be stood up. Oh, uh, well, I've been stood up once or twice. You know, I'm still alive, I'm still kicking. That doesn't mean that you deserved it. Yeah. Well, it's finally good to meet you. <laughs> I should be saying that because mm, you've done so much, my friend. And I cannot deny that I have been a beneficiary of your good deeds. Well, I'm happy to hear that. Yeah. Mm. You, do you want something to drink? Yes, sure. Mm. Yeah. All right, um, he will be here in a minute. It's fine. Yeah. You know, since I came to Nigeria about two weeks ago, I haven't set my eyes on Isabel. I mean, what's, what's going on? I mean, what's happening? I mean, is this something I did? Did I offend her or something? I, I don't understand. Why is she... I can't think straight right now, you know? I mean, you, you live in the same house as her, so I'm sure she might have told you something. I mean, is there something you can... I mean, if, if you could talk to her for me, I would appreciate that. I believe it all. Because I'm, I'm as surprised as you are. These are the same questions I keep asking her, and she too doesn't even have an answer. I mean, she's scared? I mean, she's scared I might not love her? Like insecurities or something? I mean, am I not one? I mean, or was it, was it the other way around, actually? I mean, come on, you gotta help me out here. You gotta help, you gotta talk to her for me. I, I, I've been here and I can't think straight. My head is going gaga, just being there, not knowing what is going on with her. You gotta talk to her for me, please, help me. You know what? Why don't you just put your number here okay. and um, I will call you if I have any way to help. All right. Thank you. Please. Um, anything. Just, just talk to her. Whatever it is. I mean, we can sort it out. Okay. Thank you. To where? And I say. Yeah, sure. I mean, I wanted you to help me get something from Shoprite. I'm not going that way. So where are you heading to? What is this thing you want to get from Shoprite? Do you remember the perfume my ex-boyfriend bought for me? You can't be serious. How do you expect me to remember the perfume your ex-boyfriend got you? Because I taught you good. I'm not going there, okay? I'm going to the spa, the regular spa I go to. You can expect me to remember the perfume that I export. Okay. Really? And why are you shouting? What do you mean? What, why am I shouting? You staring at you, you know. I've been staring at you for quite a while now. I'm just too damn beautiful, you know. <laughs> you know what, baby? What am I doing here? How did I get here? I'm sorry, my, my boy's out of kind of, you know. 
Did you abduct me? Ed, I'm sorry, but you left me no option. You left me no option. That's crazy. Why would you do a thing like that? What do you mean, why? I mean, the thought of losing you is making me lose my mind. I can't think straight anymore. I can't think. All I see is you. It's, it's not your fault, okay? It's just that I, I need some time. Time for what? Time to think about all of this. Babe, what are you thinking about? You keep thinking. What are you thinking about? Talk to me. You can talk to me. What are you thinking about? Tyler, Tyler, I... Baby, baby, baby. I love you. I love you all my heart. And I can think about not being with you. Do you understand that? Listen, baby. I got you everything you wanted. Everything. The thought of losing you is going to kill me. You understand that? But you keep running, I don't know why. What, what did I do wrong? You didn't do anything wrong. I just need time to process all of this. You have all the time in the world. You keep processing. Stop processing. Hey, Lisa, I got you some food. Just eat, okay? I got you a little present. Tomorrow we're going to go on our first date. It's going to be so beautiful, you know? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Try and smile. Eat up. Food is good. I made it myself. Mm. Drink that. It's good. It's good wine. Look. Not poison, not drugs, nothing. Eat up. You must be hungry. You know, I'm sure glad that you're my girl. And <laughs> you happy? Yes, I I am. <laughs> sure you are. Present. Let's go. Shall we? Um, do I get to go home after the dinner? Oh, come on, Isabel. Look, I know you're having second thoughts about all this, you know, but just give it time. Let's you know, spend some time together, you know? A few days, you know? <sighs> this few days of yours. Like how many days? I don't know. Seven days, maybe more. One week? Come on, babe, please. Let's, let's just get together and, you know, make this work. Come on, come on, come on, okay? Uh, you mean seven days? Could be more. More? Yeah, come on. Let's just go, okay? God damn it. Go 
Hey, handsome. Can I be your... Can I be your prisoner tonight? What in God's name are you doing here? Ah, oh, that's the one to bat you, they call God. Okay, they swear for you. Okay, I have nothing to say to you, okay? No, of course, except you have things to do to me. <clears throat> young lady, young lady, please. Just calm down, just leave my house, could you please? Oh, God. Calm down. See, your friend tell me say you don't break your heart. I make I say make I go make you happy. Okay, I think you need all the happiness that you can get. Oh, okay? then we get happy together. Can't you see? Who? Don't make me touch you. But I want you to touch me. Hey, what's wrong with you? <sighs> Why are you this boring? See, I know it to be your problem. But let's just, let me leave this English way with this speak. Let's just go inside. Hmm? Let's just go and do something fun, something more interesting. Okay, okay, let's, hey, 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 let's see. You don't need to put my hands on you right now, okay? Just leave. Oh, come on. I, leave now, please. You can suck up in your sorrow for all I care. Now I know why they left you. Trust me, it's hard time you stop thinking about just yourself and consider other people's feelings. Tyler, I know you're here to see Isabel, but have you sit while I get you a drink? I don't stress yourself, girl. It's okay. I'm, I'm good. I just want to see Isabel. If you just don't call her for me, I would really appreciate that.
It was good to see you, right? What did I do wrong? You did nothing wrong. Then why won't you see me? I honestly don't know. I, I don't know. She looked me in the eye and she said she don't love me. I mean, after almost a year? Is I've said that to you? I mean, what do I do now? Where do, where do I go from here? I came to Nigeria because of her. Why would she do that to me? I mean, why would she want to hurt me like this? I came here because I wanted to marry her. She knew this. If she didn't want to marry me anymore, then why did she tell me while I was in the States? She could have told me anytime. Oh, she just wanted to use me, right? It's all about the money. If she had asked me, I could have given her anyway. Why make all these promises that she knows she had no intention of keeping? That's, that's just an inhumane. Tyler, I know you're hurt. And I'm so sorry that all of this is happening. But you don't deserve to be hurt. You don't. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry for raising my voice at you. I, and I appreciate the fact that you're trying here, okay? If you could just please just talk to her, okay? I, I would really appreciate that. Could you, could you do that for me? I'll try my best. I'll keep trying. Thanks. I'm so sorry. You will talk to her, right? I will talk to her. Hey, girl. Mr. Tyler. How you doing, girl? <laughs> Welcome, Mr. Tyler. Thank you. Have a seat. See him? Don't tell me she's not in now. Unfortunately, she's not in. Oh, come on. Oh, she don't want to see me, right? She's really not in, but that doesn't mean we cannot have you sit, right? Okay, I'm making lunch, sir. I'm yeah. very sure you're going to love it. Fiona, listen, you know I, I... I know. Tyler, I know why you're here. But why not we talk about it over lunch? I mean, I don't know about you, but I'm really, really hungry. I am kind of family. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me set the table. All right. Sit. <laughs> uh. No, no. If I were to be your brother and you find yourself in this kind of precarious situation, what would your advice be to me?
Tyler, move on. I know this is tough, Tyler. And it hurts me to even say this to you, but... Like, no one deserves to be in a one-sided relationship. You have so much love to give. And you deserve as much. But I know we're not too close, and... I know everything you've done for Isabel. And I don't mind standing by you throughout this difficult time, regardless of everything you've done for someone and all the love you've given to them. If they don't love you, there's nothing you can do about it. And the more you keep waiting for Isabel to reciprocate your love, the more you keep getting hurt. So I just move on. And trust me, I promise to stand by you all the time. I'm here. Come on. Yeah, this is nice. <laughs> and I'm glad you like it. <laughs> <laughs>